Every white person I've ever met when I was a kid and I would, you know, draw a swastika on my arm, they would be like, fuck you. Nah, man, I wanna fucking, you know, try to kill a man and get paid. Would you like to learn some Chinese? Let's do it. Ni hao. What was that? Wait, what am I saying? What am I saying? Hello. Ni hao. <laughs> I, feel like, I feel like I should already start. How do you say work harder, child? <laughs> so when I start my clothing, when I start my clothing company and I open up a couple sweatshops, how do I, how do I get to the meat and potatoes of work harder? No food for you till you finish. This is another thing with fucking kids these fucking days. Like since when did suicide become fucking cool? If you cheat on me and I don't find out, I mean, so if you're going to cheat on me, just be good at it. Oh man, no, if I kill someone in the ring, I'd fucking make me very happy. All right, next question. Do you believe fat shaming is okay if the person you're fat shaming is someone you love? I think fat shaming is always okay. I There's nothing worse than being next to a fat, smelly mother And the most human thing you could do is telling a fat, smelly mother to put down the fork. Well, where do you think a win over a boost would take you? So here's the thing, you guys. I'm going to speak straight with you. I always do. I'm honest. I try to be, you know, unless I'm trying to sleep with you. I don't like to put big black things in my face like this, but we'll make it happen. I feel like you're used to it. <laughs> I don't think you're used to it. Anyways, Shisha, how do you think she got the John Jones interview? I just f with you. I'm f with you. Izzy, I'll come over to you. We can watch anime. You can put some fucking testosterone on my ass. I'll do it with you. Let's fucking go. Fight for a belt, you guys. Fucking Izzy, come on. Fucking Izzy with the titties. I gotta fight you. If it wasn't UFC, I'd probably be cooking meth in a trailer in prison, so. Uh, remember when we were talking about um, fighting is like having sex with a woman? Yes. Does that mean that Alex f***ed you? Oh, this f***ing <laughs> That, you, you f***ing. He's the number seven middleweight in the world. He's I'm not saying that the world would be better, a better place than more of me, but you guys need to get hit by your dads a little bit more. Not even hit, not like, not discipline. You guys don't need to be like, I didn't take out the trash, hit. You guys need to get like an alcoholic rage beating, and then you'll start fucking learning how to have, you know, nuts. If your stomach looks like a and you're naked and a guy doesn't know which hole to put it in, you're too fucking fat. If you want to run your fucking mouth not on the internet, you should come up to me, do it in person, and bring your fucking kids. So after I smack you in the mouth, they can watch me smack their fucking coward father, and maybe they can learn a lesson and not be a bitch like I think if I was a serial killer, I'd have to kill a woman just for equality purposes, but I wouldn't really, it wouldn't really get my hard. It wouldn't be really equality because I don't think it would be a fair Let's go! So, Empire. Yeah, apparently. Guys dating uh, Megan Fox. He has some Transformers, you know, with a broken down car. I don't know what happened to Megan Fox, dude, but <laughs> something happened to Megan Fox, you guys. I don't know who did it, but I want to find that man. I want to have a conversation with him because me and you, dude, we're not cool. I meet this vampire. Like, dude, you wake up every day and you dress like a vampire. I don't know. If, I don't know if he does or doesn't. I, maybe it's just a, a wardrobe. But dude, you dress like a vampire, man. You look like the goth kid on South Park and you go out in the world like this. Like this only happens because you are in an insulated bubble. You guys don't understand these people at these slap fights. They're not, they're not people, man. They're influencers. They're like, I interact with hundreds of people. I go snowboarding. No fan ever has anything bad to say about because I love you guys. But these people are not you guys. They are like, it's, I can't explain it until you interact with these people and you're around them. It's like, they have this weird God complex and it's just like when I'm around them, I just want to hurt them all and to remind them you are just a human being. Shut the 